Hi everyone, my name is Leo Raiden. Today I'm going to show you how you can install Aurora on your Xbox 360. So what you want to do first is you go to settings, you go to your storage and you want to format your USB drive on your Xbox 360. But no, before you do this, make sure you have backed up your USB drive because when you format it, it will erase everything in your USB drive. So you go you, you go to your USB storage device and you press Y and you go to format and if you think that you want to format you accept you say yes and that's it now just unplug your USB stick from your Xbox 360 and connect it into your computer I have a description on my video where you can download the setup files for Aurora. So I have already downloaded the files and this is the files. You extract them in a separate folder and you will have something like this. Now if you go into your USB stick, you will see content and you will see name. But let's say you cannot find content into your USB stick then you have to come to view you come to options and then you change you change the options you come you have to check you go to view you check show hidden files right here if you cannot see that content folder probably you have don't show hidden files so you take show hidden files you apply you take ok and then you can see the content folder now first thing you need to do is just copy the Aurora folder, paste it into your USB stick and you do the same for Dash Launch, Zell Launch, you do the same for XCX menu. Just copy all this into your USB stick and why that is copying? Now this last folder which says code 99, what you have to do is copy code 99 into the folder called content you open the folder called content you create a new folder in the folder called content and you're going to name it 16 zeros so we count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 you create a folder with the name 16 zeros now when it's done just open the folder copy this folder code 9999 copy into the content folder so when you are done just check your usb drive and see that you have this folder you have aurora 0.7b.1 you have the content folder you have the dash launch you have the zero launch you have the xcx menu version 1.1 in your half name now on your xbox you go to your usb storage device you go to demos you copy or you move xcx menu i'm just going to copy xcx menu into my hard drive Now, when this is done, just go back to your main screen and you want to go to games. We search for XEX menu. Yeah, I have a lot of games in my Xbox 360. So yeah, this is XEX menu. We have two copies because we have one on the hard drive and one on the USB stick. So we can just launch any one of them. That should work. So now in the XEX menu, you want to press the right bumper and this is our usb so you want to copy this files into your hard drive you press the y button you take copy and you press the x button you select your hard drive i have a folder i have created called apps so i want to go into apps and i want to press y and paste aurora into this folder called apps so to create a folder, just press the Y button and you go to create and you rename the folder 
and that's it so i want to go back to my usb drive i want to press y on dash launch copy and x again into my hard drive y paste we do the same for the other files zero launch copy to hard drive y paste USB stick and SXEX menu copy to hard drive and paste. So now we have the files in our hard drive. We don't need the USB stick anymore. So what you have to do is you can just remove your usb stick from your xbox 360 and now this is my hard drive i want to go to apps and i want to go to dash launch and launch default xcx file so now in dash launch you want to go to parts you go to default because we need to set a default dash launch so you go you go to your hard drive you go to applications the folder which you created then you go to aurora and then you select aurora as your default dash launch now what you want to do is you have to save these settings so you press the right bumper where you want to save the settings you go to your hard drive and you press the export settings, and it says settings save now you press the b button to exit and then Aurora will launch as your default dash launch when you go to home screen. Okay. So now in Aurora, you need to do some settings. For example, if you want, if you want to see the games which I have installed in my xbox 360 you press the start button you go you go to content and then you have to come to parts you need to add you need to add directly where i have the games on my xbox so i will go to set location and i will go to change i will go into my hard drive and i have these games in the folder called games so i'll press y to select this folder now I need to I need to I need to set the path. The path is I need to go exactly where the game needs to search for these games installed on my hard drive. So I will just set the path to four or five. And for the script, I want to save it, and that is done. So now I want to do a scan. I will let Alora scan for the games. So we just go back you can see that it says that i already have it found this is the games that i have and you can do the same if you want to set part for say applications or anything that you have installed on your xbox 360. so now when this is done if you need to go back to your xbox main page all you have to do is just press the xbox button on your controller and then you go to systems and you say yes you want to exit to home page and here we are this is your home page so this is how you ex install aurora on your xbox 360 so you ask if you like my video don't forget to press the like button and subscribe.